The Cabell County Career Technology Center provides hands-on learning experiences in smaller classrooms as well as opportunities for alternative learning. Offering programs of study ranging from law enforcement to graphic design and welding, students who attend classes at the Career Center receive training that prepares them for their future careers. Here's a look at what the Cabell County Career Technology Center has to offer. A lot of, been, a lot of students are not uh, what I refer to as, as the uh, traditional paper pencil student. Some of these students uh, are more successful when they're able to actually take the knowledge they're learning and apply it to what they're doing. For example, a math class, you know, you can learn formulas all day long, but until you actually see it applied in uh, a machine trade shop or a carpentry shop or uh, something of that nature, it really doesn't click as to why the, pro the formulas fit the way they do. And this gives those students the opportunity to do that. Choose your program wisely. Look at uh, all the interests that, that uh, do your research. Find out what the income potential is, what you're interested in, because uh, it's a serious commitment that you have to take to come here and learn a trade or get involved in the program. I mean, some of the programs you may want to use for simply your hobbies or to save yourself money as an adult, uh, learning how to plumb your own house or learning how to fix your own vehicle. Uh, some of those things are, that are accompanied there. Uh, don't think for a minute that you can't come to school here and still go to college. You absolutely can. As a matter of fact, because of our small nature here, uh, you get more one-on-one -on -one attention and actually it, it probably prepares you pretty well to, to go on further. I know that the misconception for years has been that this is not the place to go if, you're, if you intend on attending college, but that's not by any stretch of the imagination true. Well, again, I alluded to that just a little bit ago. Uh, you're learning here a lifelong trade. Uh, a lifelong activity that you can start at an entry level position and work your way up. Uh, give you an example, we have a student here that's in a 13th year program, which is the year after you graduate. You can come back and complete. Let's say you start programs here are typically two years. You start a program your senior year. You can come back your 13th year and complete that program. And had a student yesterday that was called for a job interview. He interviews today at 1030. And the job's going to start out at somewhere in the neighborhood of 16 to 18 dollars an hour. That's entry level. So those things are, you know, those things happen every day here. And it prepares you because, number one, it teaches you the sim with simulated workplace. It teaches you what to expect in the workplace. It teaches you teamwork, problem-solving skills, soft skills that you have to have in order to apply for a job, such as the interview skills, written language, things of that nature that you're going to have to use to uh, cooperate and, and learn on, on the job. Uh, punctuality being here on time, responsibility. Each one of our simulated workplace companies have a hierarchy, such as a foreman, a safety manager, a product specialist, um, quality control, just like you would on the job. So it, th those things, that uh, those soft skills and those leadership skills that they're learning here in the simulated workplace will carry them regardless of what occupation they choose later on in life. Well, th again, this is one of those situations where we're working really hard here to break that stigma that the Career Center is not for everyone. It's, it's for anyone who has an interest in, in uh, enhancing their life, their quality of life, uh, their leadership skills, their um, work skills, soft skills for getting a job. Uh, even if you want to, you know, you see yourself down the road going into the medical field, you still have to learn those potential soft skills in order to get hired in, into a place. And uh, one of the main things I can stress here is that regardless of your talent level, regardless of your skill level, uh, it's, it's, it comes down to really, I have so many employers tell me I would hire this person in a minute, but they can't pass a drug test. So I can't stress enough how important it is to weigh your options on that you know, when, when you're looking at those, making a bad decision or, or a silly decision to look at how it's going to affect everything. Everything trickles and how this is going to have a trickle down effect on everything you do in terms of your workplace or getting a job or maintaining that job. Uh, so that, those are just really important items you have to take a look at as a, as a young person. Of course, we have Sarah studying and learning it on the book work and taking a test on it before we come down here for safety reasons. And when I come down here, it's easier for me to do it. I'm more of a hands-on person to do it. My program of study prepares me for the world after high school by working with my CTE and getting me ready for a simulated workplace. We do a drug testing here, random drug testing. We work with other um, students as of if they were our other employees with us and our bosses there at this business that we're working together on. 
the advantages of well, enrolling in one of these studies is I can go if I wanted to and I really love collision repair. If I wanted to, when Randy Willow, my instructor, will help me actually get a job in collision repair. He actually has had businesses contact him about other students and he has actually given other students jobs. Probably the students. I enjoy working with students. Hopefully they're gaining something and they'll make them employable at some point. In a nutshell, it gets them ready for employment, application interview process, gets them ready to be employed with a time clock. We have a drug testing program. It's close to being in a workplace. If a student was considering taking this program, uh, I would recommend that there should be some interest in the automotive field. There's a lot of jobs to have in this area. So it's a good occupation, uh, well paid. I would recommend the program, but you would have to have an interest in inclusion of Actually, I like teaching electricity. Um, I taught heating and air conditioning for 16 years, and I left for three. And uh, coming back and actually getting into a new program, I really like it. And I also like the fact that, that it gives students another option other than college. Um, uh, a lot of students will go to college, and they determine that that's just not for them, and then they think that they're stuck at Walmart where actually they come out and study to be an electrician while they're in high school. And right now, master electricians have an average salary of $61,000 a year with a range of $41,000 a year to $93,000 a year. So there are options out there other than college. Uh, the advantages of coming here is you have uh, much smaller classes. Okay, you get more help, individual help from teachers. And again, it gives them a trade that they can go out and find a job. As in, right now, there is a shortage of electricians with an additional need of increase of 14% in the next five to eight years. So they have a skill that they can go out and earn a very good living the rest of their life. And they can get it for free while they're in high school. The simulated workplace is actually we, we have within our second year students. It is a company format. It is a student driven program where we have um, shop foremans, we have project managers, we have safety coordinators. And uh, they actually will, I will take a unit and I will teach it to those four students and then they teach it to the rest of the class. And it, it, kind of gives them a an ideal of what is going to be expected of them whenever they go out and are in the workforce. Uh, actually, like I said, electricity is a very good program. It's a good trade to get into. Um, there's plenty of jobs. The jobs are good paying jobs. And the skilled trades are some of those jobs that cannot be outsourced. Okay? I'm not going to call Mexico or India to get an electrician. Whereas some of the, the uh, jobs where you're behind a desk or whatever, they can outsource those very easily. And we've seen that happen quite a bit. But the actual hands-on work, we can't outsource. Um, I enjoy most is probably just being up here. I have a lot of friends up here. Uh, my family's like big and electric. My grandpa was an inspector. My uncle's into it, and I just I always liked it. Um, I'll be able to get a job pretty much like right out of high school instead of like having to go to college and pay for that, and it's free during high school. Um, advantages of going here is like it's it's more like meaningful, I guess, is like than just taking like regular classes, I guess. Um, I mean, I would say do it because I, mean, I think it's worth it. Definitely. More than, I like it way better than going to regular school. What I enjoy the most is I enjoy taking a student that has 
no concepts of construction and watching them grow into a mechanic and learning how to fix things on their own. Every student that comes to this school has the advantage that once they get out of high school they will be able to gain employment through the coursework here. Uh, I would tell every student that this school is definitely an option uh, regardless of whether you plan on going to college or not you can always learn more careers and more skills that can you can relate to later on in life whether you plan on doing it for a living or if you just plan on being able to repair your own stuff to where you don't have to have anybody else do it. Uh, but Simulated Workplace is trying to get every student involved in activities that they're going to see once they get out into the workforce to go ahead and try to prepare them for their future on the job market. Uh, I'm in the automotive mechanics. Our program does the simulated workplace which involves um, experience like <clears throat> you would have out in the real world. Uh, we do uh, actual customer vehicles. We do uh, anything from work orders to learning how to order parts and work on vehicles. Our program benefits us because once we uh, graduate from our two-year class here, we get uh, the automotive certification, which puts us at industry standards for going out and applying for any job we want in the automotive field. Once you leave here, you can basically work and know the basics and if you want to further your education by going to college, you can. It's really up to you. Uh, my most, I guess, enjoyed being here as a whole is the smaller classes, which is the more core classes. Uh, everybody knows you. We're good at working together in groups. And then our, in our shop classes, we uh, I, I like working on the vehicles mainly. I like hands-on and experience it right there in front of you. Well, I have been working on cars for since I was little, little, and ever since I started working, it's always want, I've always wanted to come in here and work on cars and learn what I didn't learn in the past. Why, why I did come here instead of technical. I come here because I would have had to wait, waited until I got out of school and then went there. With this, I can get my schooling here and get my degree from here. I chose it because it's a smaller environment, it's more hands-on, and you honestly just learn more because your education is tailored to what you enjoy. Um, my favorite thing about my business technology program is that you learn how to make PowerPoints or even letters look professional and be taken seriously in a job in your future careers that you want to do or even if you're just giving a presentation to say your classmates. I would advise them to just do it. It's really fun here. It's more hands-on. You learn more because as I said your education is tailored to what you want to do so you have a more of an initiative to want to learn. My favorite thing about teaching this program, it's something I'm interested in. I've always been interested in criminal justice and law enforcement. Um, it's, it's my passion. So I get to come to work and teach students what I love. Um, the amount of hands-on activities that the students get to, to do, um, a lot of law enforcement officers don't get the experience until they get into the academy. These students actually get a first hands-on approach to things that they're going to learn in the police academy if they choose to go into law enforcement. Uh, I would tell them to keep the record clean, stay out of trouble. Um, there's always a background investigation and no matter if you do something before you're 18 it will always follow you. So if you're planning on going to any branch of the criminal justice field, stay out of trouble, do what you're supposed to. Uh, essentially, my class has started before I even walk through the door. I am the captain of our simulated workplace company, which is the Division of Law and Order. Um, I have a lieutenant that actually takes charge of the class, that does attendance, does my lunch count, runs the class, 
takes care of discipline issues if somebody's not doing their work. Um, of course, if it gets too intense, then I, I step in and handle it. Yeah. Um, but essentially, they, they run the classroom. Um, my favorite thing about being here is probably running the class and learning different stuff that helps you out in the real world. It helps us after high school because normally people who get a high school degree don't get the job. But if you have like a career degree behind it, you're most likely to get a job or an interview before the person with a high school degree is. Because the career center is a better benefit for me and it's a career that I want to go into on public safety. I want to go into forensics, so it'll help me benefit my life. The people, really. The people, like, they're just so inviting, and they're so nice, and just, that's my favorite part, is the people. The teacher, he's fun to be around. Um, yeah. Um, it's, uh, whenever I have job interviews anywhere, I tell them about being here, and they're like, oh, that's cool, and all that stuff, so. It's fun, you get, you do a lot of hands-on stuff in every class, not just your CTE classes. I think my someone just told me about it and it seemed fun so I thought just to give it a try so but it turned out good so getting to come here instead of you know being at a regular high school where all you do is work and you can actually do hands on I'd say just like she said it benefits you in the long run if you're getting a job you can put it on your resume it's definitely a good option what I enjoy most about teaching this program is uh, I've been doing this for about 25 years, doing graphic design and teaching, and the ability and, and the opportunity to be able to teach my students the same, the same skill sets that I've learned and, and, and keep up with standard, uh, the industry standards. Oh, my favorite part about the program is the students. Uh, being able to teach them new things, see the excitement they have, being able to hone their skills, uh, taking something that they enjoy and teaching them another aspect of it, such as from art to graphic arts. Well, CMA Workplace, we operate just like a business. I mean, we have managers in my class. We have uh, client service managers. We have print shop managers, graphic design managers. We have safety teams. We operate just, just like a business. If I was the owner and these students are my workers, right, it's one of the best kept secrets in Cabell County. I mean, you know, even though you may take an art class or a graphics class at the high school, uh, at the career center, you get an opportunity to see not only how the program runs, but to be able to operate a business. It becomes a student-led program, not necessarily a teacher-led program. It's an opportunity of a lifetime. If a student doesn't know what they want to do and they're interested in the arts and they're interested in, in advertising or graphics of some type or any type of program that we have here, the, the CCCTC is a great opportunity for them. <laughs> This program is good because it's designed for ninth and 10th graders, so I really enjoy starting with them uh, to learn all the tools and equipment that we can work and build stuff safely in the shops. Uh, favorite thing is uh, the accomplishment. We get a lot of things done. We build uh, benches for Huntington High. Or we build picnic tables for the schools. We've done uh, stuff for the uh, uh, different academies to help them and assist them. It's, it's a good feeling to have something accomplished and completed. You can actually come in and it's a hands-on opportunity to build stuff and to have an accomplishment with that. And also it's good to uh, be career ready. Once you get out of this school, you're ready to move on and, and, and pick a career and, and uh, strive to reach your goals. Um, I would tell them it would be a good, good idea, especially if they're uh, mature enough and want to get started on a career and know what path they want to go into. Uh, it's good to come to the school and uh, follow those dreams. Uh, the only thing is that this program is a one-year program. It's a building technology academy, and it's a one-year program that you can work and figure out what area you want to go into exactly in the construction area. If you want to go to heating there, electrical, or carpentry, you can do mine for one year and then go into another class that's going to be actually for two years. Well, you know, I enjoy uh, the fact that you get you fur you further education more, I'd say, farther than just your academic classes. You know, you learn hands-on skills, and, uh, you know, you learn your tools, safety, you know, stuff that would apply even in a job site, like an office or anything. You know, you learn safety and all kinds of stuff. Well, I enjoy working with my hands, and... I figured this would help me a lot more than just focusing on academic classes. A student's favorite thing about the program is probably getting to learn what maybe they either grew up seeing their family do or maybe they've had an interest in it, so I guess 
just doing what they like. How each program prepares them for the workplace, I'd probably say it's simulated workplace, so we have to come in on time. We have to clock in as if it was a job. We come down, we have positions such as a foreman, uh, quality control, safety manager, so it gets you into the mind state that there's different levels in a workplace and that you have to be prepared for that. The advantages of enrolling into a program here, probably the fact that you're still learning what you need to learn to graduate, but you're also getting to learn something that you'll want to do in the future instead of waiting until you graduate to learn it. Similar workplace works, basically we, every student in a classroom gets a role. Their role, depending on what their role is, is to either make sure that the tour room's clean, make sure everyone's working, giving them tasks to do. We go by uh, enrollment uh, stages. we got to clock in the right time. If you don't clock in, you get grade cut as if you were to get a pay cut. What I'd tell a student if they were considering coming here is that you wouldn't regret it. You get to learn everything you learned at the high school, and if you have a job that you're wanting to do and you're afraid you can't learn at Huntington High School, here they'll share everything you need to know and probably more. The thing I enjoy most about being here is you actually get treated like a person. You know, when you come here, they want you to be treated like an adult. You know, you come to these classes, you use skills that you're actually going to use in the real world. They want you to be treated like you're actually going to be in the real world when you're here. So when you're here, you actually get treated with respect. Each program study prepares you for the real world and the fact that you not only get the real world training on real world equipment that they're actually going to have when you go into the industry, but you also get a certification you can sit down on your employer's desk and say, yes, I know what I'm doing and I've, I've done it and I'm certified for it. The advantages of rolling in a program of study here is that when you're here, you actually get to use good equipment and when you go there, you have a certification. When you walk in, sit down for your job interview, you can sit that certification down on the table and be like, I know what I'm doing. I've done it before. I went to school for it. And, you know, it gives you a really good step in the door for any job. What I would tell a student that's considering CCCTC as an option is that it's a great school. It's the best choice I've ever made with my life. Come in here, you know, you you get treated good. You're around people that actually want to be here. You're not at a home high school like Cabell Midland or Huntington High where you're around people that don't want to be there. When you come here, you're around people that actually come here and strive to work and do their jobs. So it's a great place to be and you get real world training. What I enjoy most about teaching this program, Machine Tool Technology, is my students. They're very inquisitive. Uh, machine Tool Technology prepares my students for an entry level position in the workplace, and they actually have manageable skills. The advantage of Cabell County Career Technology Center is that we do everything hands-on along with the academics. All the academics, math, English, everything is hands-on. We feel our academics. It's just great being here. My students have fun. Uh, we try to make it enjoyable for all of our students here at the Career Center. They want to come here. Not that it would be they have to come here. What do I enjoy most about teaching this program? Uh, mainly all the information that I've gotten over the years through welding. I've always wanted to give it back to the kids or teach it to people. So that's my favorite thing is giving back. Uh, this prepares students in the manner of how to weld properly, how to get jobs, how to do anything that helps them out in the working world. Uh, we actually do simulate workplace so that way they get a taste of all of it firsthand. So, uh, basically what you're doing is you're setting up the shop to run like it was outside, like you were actually working a job or a company. So you've got leaders, you've got bosses, you've got people who work under other people. And we all work together as a team so that way when they do go get a job, they know exactly what they're doing. I would definitely choose it because these days, as far as job-wise, everybody's looking for someone with a trade. A lot of people have four-year degrees, but they don't exactly get those jobs. You can go through this program in two years and get a good paying job. Uh, just, I would like to say about the Career Center, I love it here. It's great opportunities. I strongly suggest anybody who's wanting to go out in the trades position that they come here. I enjoy being able to explore and my trade that I'm trying to maybe look forward to uh, getting a career into. like to be able to train a little bit, get a little bit of practice in that, see if I like it, if that's what I want to do. Well, my program that I'm doing here, welding, it would uh, assist me because I have past experience from here going into either a job or going into a technical college. I chose the uh, trade center because I wanted to uh, learn how to weld. 
something I'd like to go into. My favorite thing about the program is the amount of freedom we have. Not like we have like whatever we do, but we can do side projects and then do what we have to do. There's just a lot of freedom they give us, which is awesome. The advantages of enrolling at the program are you'll get a trait that you may need in the future in case things don't work out too well. You learn some awesome skills. The program benefiting me already is teaching me things I wouldn't have learned on my own, giving me knowledge that I would have never got if I never went here. I chose a career center instead of a typical high school education because they actually teach me something I'll use later in my life than me doing simple math or reading or writing because some people don't find that interesting. More hands-on is the way to go here. I love it here at the Career Center. It's This is my third year out here and um, the classes are smaller. We have an hour and a half, so I get to spend more time with the students, and we can go a little more in depth, you know, with fewer students and more time. Well, not only do we have academics, but students leave here with a set of skills that they can use, you know, in life. They can go right into the career field, or they can further their education at college. We have a lot of great programs out here and a lot of opportunities for all different kinds of students I would definitely suggest to students to give us a look and see if we can do something for them I'd say I think you should do it I think it's a wonderful option I think if you feel like you don't really fit in at the high school I think the Career Center would be a better place for you I think if you like smaller groups of people in one classroom I think the Career Center is a perfect choice for you if you like working with your hands that's Career Center perfect choice I chose it because I figured I'd be get to work with more of my hands, and at the high school, I didn't really get to do that. I didn't really get the option to do that. Most of it was just book work and class work. What do I enjoy most about teaching in this program? I like the fact that the students get to do a lot of projects here, that they do hands-on, they get to manipulate things, uh, and they get to see it in the real-world context. I would say come to the Career Center as soon as you can. This is probably one of the best programs I've seen for preparing students uh, for what they're going to face in the real world. I would like to say this about the Career Center. If you've never thought about coming here, you ought to at least come out for a day and take a look at us. Uh, what you find here is something you won't find in a typical high school, and I think you'll be very well prepared for the real world once you come here. What I enjoy most about being here is that we have mostly a lot of freedoms and we have a lot of privileges up here and you can really get a lot more hands-on education than you can at any other high school. Uh, I enjoy all the freedom that we get up here. Um, it's more hands-on, smaller classes, the teachers are really nice and we get more time to do our work on our own and but if we have problems we can just ask the teachers and they can usually help us. Uh, well my big thing was as soon as I get out of high school I don't plan on going to college so as soon as I get out of high school, I can go right into a job and have a good trade. Well, I teach English here, so it's high school English, and I typically have 11th and 12th grade. I like it because I've really gotten to know my students really well, and, and you can offer a more supportive environment because our classes are a little smaller, and we can work closely together. I, I think the advantage is because when you get out of high school, you can go straight to work, and for kids particularly who may not be interested in going to college, this gives them a viable option to graduate high school and, and be trained and ready to go. Um, I would say keep an open mind um, and even ask if you couldn't come out here and maybe spend the day and try to get an idea if this would be a good fit. Uh, most of the kids who come here find that they really, really like it, so I, I would say give us a shot. I think this has been one of the best places I've ever worked. It's just such a positive environment and like I said, we, we usually don't have kids quit and leave if that tells you anything. And, you know, kids really work hard to stay here, so I, I think that's proof of, of what we can offer. The center offers many different trades for a two-year certification as well as a smaller environment for your typical core classes. The Cabell County Career and Technology Center encourages students to focus on their individual goals, training today's students for tomorrow's changing workplace.